Let's take a few minutes to show you a demo of our actual platform. Two of our most popular courses are Microsoft Excel and Financial Modeling. To make it clear about how it works, I'd like you to get a taste of the end user experience as if you were a student using the platform for the first time. Here you can see the guided simulation interface where you can try and at the same time build muscle memory. On this platform, you can absorb 90% of information with guided simulation and spaced repetition compared to watching video alone, which is suboptimal. There is an overall progress bar here and an efficiency score where people can become two times, three times, and even five times more efficient. For one of our clients, Meadon and More, we've seen an incredible gain for one person to reach an efficiency score of 16 times. If an efficiency score is 2x, it means that any task you were doing in two hours, you can now do in one hour. The more you practice well, the more productive you become. An initial IQ test is taken here, where you're asked in this case, 20 questions to test your initial baseline level of knowledge. And then we take another IQ test at the end of each submodule. Your first assessment IQ is measured here. And then if you repeat this over time, your best assessment will be shown over here. Let's go to a section of the actual simulation based training. Here we're going to learn how to project revenue growth. When I enter, I'm asked to perform a number of requests. What I'm doing is actually typing in keystrokes now on my keyboard and getting real time feedback. It's classic learning by doing. If I type the instruction carefully and correctly, I move on to the next one. And if not, it wobbles here in red. It's this loop that will enhance your training. Once I complete these two topics within the sub module, I'm asked to do a skill set IQ, which we strongly encourage in order for the overall efficiency score to update over time. At the end of the course, you'll actually be given a downloadable case study to solve. In this case, you're asked to calculate the equity value per share based on what you've learned in the prior training module. And you're expected to do this offline and then come online again, where you'll be asked various questions about the case study. 